As Simulation X continues to adapt to our customers' new applications around testing their machines and vehicles in virtual proving grounds, we're introducing new features to improve visualization of 3D geometries and environments, as well as to use 3D data for calculation of contacts. One of the new features is the import of OBJ sceneries for visualization of the scene or for a better visualization of a vehicle or other object. This feature is available to all Simulation X users as part of the Simulation X Professional Edition. OBJ files are imported via the 3D Scene Explorer. The 3D Scene Explorer can be accessed through the Tools ribbon that appears when the 3D view is activated. To provide a realistic background to your MBS models, a scene can be imported by attaching the geometry to the model. Right-click on the model in the 3D Scene Explorer and choose Import Geometry. It may take a minute or two to import very large files. To provide a more realistic visualization for an MBS body, right-click on the body in the 3D Scene Explorer and choose Import Geometry. OBJ files imported in this way are just for visualization and do not affect the physics of the model. New elements have also been introduced in Simulation X 4.3 to consider 3D ground and point contacts. The new triangulated ground and point contact elements enable you to consider an uneven surface that serves as a global ground to the model. To carry out the contact calculation, the user can attach a point-shaped contact object to an exposed point of an MBS body to model a contact physics between it and the ground. The contact force calculation method can be selected and parameterized in the parameter dialog. This model, which can be found in the sample browser of Simulation X, demonstrates the point contact using several balls, but the point contact could also be used to model the ground contact from the bucket of a loader, the header of a swather or harvester, or other types of scenarios where a machine part contacts an uneven surface. The Driving Maneuvers module has been extended with interfaces to two standard tire models, SimCenter Tire and F-Tire. These tire models enable you to calculate the interaction between the tire and an uneven ground surface, and also to consider the impact of tire parameters, as well as tire and wheel inertia on vehicle dynamics. The new Simulation X elements provide interfaces to these two third-party tire models. Valid licenses for the third-party tire models are required, and can be obtained directly from the corresponding third party. The Driving Maneuvers module is in process of being adapted to maneuver or mission simulations for a wider range of industries. As one of the initial steps, aerospace vehicle models have been added to the library. These models and corresponding elements enable you to set up models with six degrees of freedom that consider the effect of pressure forces. They can be used to calculate the flight dynamics of heavier-than-air vehicles, like planes or vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, thus making it possible to use Simulation X as an integration platform for applications like validation of system performance and safety or optimization of system operations.